Honorable has left Manchester United. He joined Sevilla on a loan with a buy option. And I'm I'm very annoyed. I'm very annoyed because I really, really like Honorable. And I've seen some United fans um, say that, that he's not good enough. That, uh, well, well, he hasn't really shown anything. And these are the same people who rave about Facundo Palestri. Facundo Palestri is dog shit. That guy's been given enough opportunities in the team, but yet people think that he's some 18-year-old kid. The guy's 21 years old. The guy's 21 years old. Look at his size. Uh, what has he really done? He has no pace. He just has technical ability. And he, he, he can rarely beat his man. He can rarely do anything. Facundo Palestri, he is shit. He is dog shit. 21 years old. We've paid like 8 million for him. And and people rave about Facundo Palestri. And they want people like Harnable to leave Manchester United. Listen, Harnable, Harnable's been fit throughout this entire season. Every time he's played in the Premier League, he's caught. Listen, every time he's been subbed on, he's been like the opportunities he's given it has been terrible. He's never complained. When Manchester United were down like 7-0 against Liverpool, who who you think came on? It's Harnable. It was Harnable coming on, fouling everyone, uh, you know, trying to show the, the more experienced players what it means to play for Manchester United. And then I, I remember this season as well. I think we're we we are losing to to was it this season or last season we we're losing to, to Leicester or someone, three 0 down, Harnable comes. Scores a, a beautiful goal outside the box. But it, it's Honorable for me, has just been really impressive. I liked him when he played. He's, he's always gets um, into tackles. He's always tracking back. He covers a huge amount of ground. And when he gets the ball, he can run with it. He carries the ball well. Uh, and, and I think going forward, attacking-wise, there's still a, a much more that we, we will see from Honorable. And we're probably going to see that at, at Sevilla. So, yeah, I'm really disappointed. Thank God. Thank God we have a buyback clause in Honorable. Um, but I'm still annoyed that, that we let him go because I think we need him. I really do think we need him for the rest of the season. You look at Mason Mount. Yeah, since Mason Mount has came to Manchester, he's missed so many games through injuries. Did he still been, he's, he, he probably still has more minutes on the pitch than Honorable. Honorable has been given less opportunity, has less time than Mason Mount, but he's done more in that time. And listen, if you ask me who would I rather keep, Honorable or Mason Mount, without a doubt, I'm choosing Honorable. Without a doubt, I genuinely believe Honorable is a better player than Mason Mount. What has Mason Mount done for Manchester United? He's just been injured all the time. He's just been injured. And, and Honorable has just consistently been fit. He's 20 years old. He's been fighting. He's, he's never complained. Listen, I'm I'm really disappointed he let Honorable go. Uh, for the fans that don't think he's good enough, oh, wow, I, I have no words. I have absolutely no words. When are we going to sell Facundo Palestri? Get him gone. Get players like him gone. But listen, I, I assume that this is all to do with financial fair play. They are trying to sell some youngsters so that we can sign players. Well, you're better sign someone in the January transfer window, if you letting go of these these young players, you've also let go of um, Alvaro Fernandez, another very good player, uh, a left back, Spanish left back who signed from Real Madrid. Um, I was confused why he wasn't given an opportunity when we had two left backs injured. Instead, we signed Regulon for on loan, who's done pretty well. But I mean, why not give Alvaro Fernandez a chance? We've let him go to Benfica. Also a buyback clause. I'm I'm just happy and thankful there is buyback clauses in both deals for Honorable and Alvaro Fernandez. Both, if developed well, I hope Manchester United go back in for them. Um, um, but I am happy for Honorable. I think he deserves much more game time. This would be a good move for him going to Sevilla, a, a good league, a good club. Um, maybe he can learn off Sergio Ramos because he definitely has that um that fire. That you always see Sergio Ramos plays with. So hopefully he learns, picks up a few things from Sergio Ramos and comes back to Manchester United because I really, really like Honorable. I think he's a top player. Thank you guys for watching. Consider subscribing.
and I'll see you guys in the next one.